Hey everybody, Dan with The Modern Defender and today we're going to discuss five things that you need to know about your SIG P365. Stick around. Alright, so the first thing you're going to want to know is that some have had problems with the SIG 365 locking back after the last round has been shot in the magazine. Now I've had this happen to me and I've had it happen definitely with the flush mount 10 round mag probably five out of ten times the mag the 10 round mag with the pinking extension i've had it happen less and i've never had it happen with the 12 round mag if i do this with my 10 round mag with the pinky extension it happens a lot less okay if you notice my thumb is sitting so much lower already just from that simple little pinky extension so it's gonna grab every single time. Again, I've had it happen a couple of times with this 10 round mag with the pinky extension, um, but I've never had it happen with the 12 round magazine, okay? It just doesn't happen. You are, your thumb is so low up, even when you've got that good grip on there, your thumb is nowhere near it. When you have this flush mount 10 round mag, you have to grip so much higher up that you'll find that your thumb will rest on top of the slide, uh, the slide lock, making it very difficult for that to grab on the last round. Okay, so it will not lock back. So the second thing you're going to want to know about is the the reassembly issues. Okay, so a lot of folks have had problems reassembling the 365. It's been a problem with the reassembly. So you push the takedown lever down, release the slide, and it's going to slide right off. The problem is when it's come to reassembly. If this takedown lever is not straight down, this will not reassemble. This will not go back on. So the way you're going to do that is you're going to engage the slide lock by pressing it up, taking the takedown lever, pushing it straight down, then this sucker will go right back on. Now one of the things you want to know is this takedown lever will not slide back into place easily. So you want to lock the slide back and that should pop right back up into place. Okay. Then she's ready to go. Now I do have the Lima laser sight on this and I did a video for that so if you want to see that video it's right here just click that link. Okay so the next thing you're going to want to know about your SIG P365 is you're going to want to clean it more than you'd normally typically clean a regular carry gun um, and the reason for that is I've noticed with this SIG right here the back of the trigger is hollowed out. Now again, you always want to clean your carry gun, okay? But for some reason I've noticed this gun collects more lint than any other gun that I've ever owned before. Um, and I've carried, you know, quite a few carry guns and this one for some reason, I'm not sure if it's the size, but I've noticed the hollowed out back of this trigger, that's where it tends to collect a lot of dust and what'll end up happening is it'll get stuck inside behind the trigger and you're gonna wanna make sure you clean that out. Um, you want your carry to gun, carry gun to be reliable when you need it. And keeping a carry gun clean, even if you don't go to the range with it that often, it's something you still need to do. So I'd say at least once a month, take this thing apart, clean it, blow any dust or lint that's been stuck inside of it out, so that way you know your gun's clean if you need it. The next thing you're going to want to know about your SIG P365 is it's exceptionally reliable. I have well over 2,000 rounds through this, and I have had not had one failure to go into battery or misfire. So this is something that you, you want out of your carry gun. You want your carry gun to be as reliable as possible. Well, the SIG P365 certainly fits what you want. And on top of that, the night sights are just exceptional. So I highly recommend this gun as a carry gun. Like I've said, well over 2,000 rounds through this thing and not once has it failed to go into battery. And the last thing that you're going to want to know about your SIG P365 is that there is virtually no profile. I have the 12 round magazine on right now, and as you can see, there's no profile. Okay, I can bring the gun out, I can present it, okay, reholster, re cover it up again, and there's nothing to see. So that really makes the SIG P365 the ultimate concealed carry gun right out of the box. And having the ability to carry 13 rounds on me gives you almost the same ability as a Glock 19. So that is one of the things that I really love about the SIG P365 between its reliability, its capacity, 
and the fact that it's well made and has amazing night sights on it, you're gonna love your Sig P365. I love mine. Hey, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. We'll see you next time on the Modern Defender. Stay safe out there, everybody.